Hey everyone, Rick here, and folks, I just wanted to do a quick video of my haul from Gothicon 2023. This was their third year. This was my first time ever going. It was located at Haunted Hollow in La Vista, Nebraska. So yeah, really excited to go, and oh my gosh, you guys, I had an absolute blast. So let's go through everything that I picked up, starting with this bag, because as soon as I walked in, the first thing I wanted to do, because it was muggy as hell, I wanted a water, I wanted something to drink, so I ran to the concession stand and I got a bottle of water and a Dr. Pepper, and then instantly I was already like, oh my gosh, I'm going to need like a bag or something to carry all my stuff. Because then I immediately went to the merch stand and picked up a couple things, which we'll look at in a second. And then I really needed a bag to put stuff in. So I picked up this. I'm not going to pick up the tripod all the time, but just so you get a sense of how big this bag is. This is a decent sized bag. I thought it was very cool. It was only five bucks, and I was like, I'm going to get a bunch of stuff here today, so I might as well um, get this bag. So we got that, and then I also ended up putting some charms on here because there were a couple of other booths that I eventually got to, and I'm not doing this in chronological order, of course. One of the booths had these adopt a dead fairy for a dollar. So this de this undead fairy was a buck and I immediately put it on the bag. And then this, which reminds me of like a gnome, but it is this adorable little uh, hat with a charm on it. And um, yeah, this was absolutely fantastic. This was the color scheme that I went with for this little guy. So the bag two of these dangly charms for the bag. And now let's actually crack the bag open and see what we've got. Okay, so speaking of that merch stand, we ended up picking up both a custom Gothicon mug. And then also, of course, we could not go without our Gothicon t-shirt, Gothicon at Haunted Hollow. Just a plain black T with the logo on there. So, grabbed a couple of pieces of merch. And then, look at this. I got four packages of incense, all different. They were 25 cents for the whole pack. I don't even know how many is in here. Ten? Like eight or ten sticks per bag. Rose incense, sexy uh, Dracar Noir and Frankincense. So four packs for a dollar because it was 25 cents a pack. That was pretty good. That was the first thing I said when I walked into that booth. I was like, 25 cent incense? That was pretty sweet. And then at another booth, I tried to get, uh, you know, something from a lot of different booths. Um, so I got this. They had bags of all shapes and sizes, um, but I was like, this would be a perfect dice bag. I love these like rainbow cupcakes. Yeah, this is fantastic. The drawstring is actually really thick. This is a fantastic, perfect size for either a dice bag or I like drawing things out of bags a lot of times, like tokens and stuff. So that is also perfect. This was the perfect size. They had smaller, they even had larger of several different prints. This was the print I wanted and this was the size I wanted. This was a perfect size. Next, oh, these were adorable. At another booth that had a bunch of crocheting things. These are coasters. These are little pumpkin crocheted coasters. How cute are those? A set of what, four? So yeah, that's fantastic. And a lot of this stuff was reasonably priced. Like I believe this was a $12 bag. This was a $10 set of these coasters. Again, a dollar for the sticks. Um, $5 for this bag. This fairy dangling was a dollar. This um, hanging gnome looking guy was like 10 bucks. All right, now next, this. This is very cool. Look at this, Mimic chest hopefully the light is doing this justice but it's like a treasure chest that was painted and then the mimic part was sculpted and they did such a good job on this and it was between this colorway or a blue and i was having trouble and uh the guy was like do you want to um 
uh, choose? Do you want me to like help sway you one way or the other? And I was like, absolutely. And so they said, hey, let's uh, go with uh, this. This is my favorite color. So I went with the green. Green with the purple eye, but look at that. And it's magnetic closure. It's got a tongue in there. But that is just so freaking cool. Absolutely love that. Next, what do we have here? Oh my gosh, okay, so this gets really exciting, but we're gonna have to pull it away so I can like actually lay it out or actually show it off somehow. So how do we wanna do that? Let's do it like over here, yeah. So this was Alchemist Art. I hope I get that name right. I had a card, I had so many cards for so many of these people, but um, I can't remember if I had one for this individual or not, but this was fantastic. So this is a hoodie and it's kind of a white, it's like an off-white, which I absolutely love. So as you can see, it's a hoodie and we have that, that's just the front thing, but then the back is where it's really at. I gotta pull this away. Can you see that better now? Yeah, that's just so freaking cool. So, uh, it's an artist who does a lot of prints like this. And, but they also had t-shirts and hoodies. And see, that's where you get me. Because as much as I admire the prints, when I can wear it, that is what I want. So I got this, this was fantastic, I couldn't believe it. What size was this, an XL I think? Yep, so, yep, that'll be fantastic. And then I'm going to leave the camera there because the next thing, and this is the last thing, and I do have a card handy right here for this person. Take a peek at this. Yeah, as soon as I saw this hoodie, I was like, yep, we've got to get that. Number one, Hellraiser. No tears, please. Look at that art. Are you kidding me? This art is fantastic. The colors of the hoodie, it's like this cotton candy pastel pink blue purple combo. The hoodie itself is absolutely amazing. It does have this chain detailing on the sleeves. But this, I saw the colors of the hoodie. I saw the art that absolutely blew me away. They even tag themselves on the top of the hood. And if you are at all interested in that style of art, which I cannot absolutely blame you for, here is their card. So absolutely got to give them a shout out for sure. And that is what I picked up, folks. We got a lot of fantastic things. I spent so much more money than I <laughs> thought I was going to when I first walked in. That's why it was a great thing I got this bag. This bag is absolutely fantastic. It's huge for five bucks. Absolutely. So we got a couple hoodies, a t-shirt, a cup, some coasters, some incense, a dice bag, a mimic chest, some bag charms, or I don't know what I'll do with them. I may leave them on the bag. I may hang them somewhere else. But yeah, so absolutely fantastic haul. And that'll do it, folks. Thank you all so much for watching. I do truly appreciate it. And until next time.